First, go to this page from the link in the description. Here, you will find some files. If you have 32-bit windows, then download the 32-bit version. But I have 64-bit windows, so I am downloading 64-bit version. It may ask us to wait, then the download will start. I have copied the downloaded file in desktop. Right-click it and extract the zip file. The file has been extracted. For simplicity, we will rename this folder as Lua. We no longer need this zip file, so delete it. Open the Lua folder and copy the path. Minimize this window and type environment variables in the search bar. Click the first search result. You will get in window. Click on environment variables. Then in the system variables, you will find path. Right click on it and edit it. Click new and paste the path you copied. Click OK, and it is completed. After this, come to the desktop and create a folder for storing our scripts. Inside the folder, create a little file. I am naming it first Lua script. You can give any name you want to this file. We must change the file extension from txt to Lua because this is a Lua script file. It asks for confirmation, click yes. Sometimes you won't see the extension of file. To view the extension, click on view and enable this file name extension option. Now open this Lua file with any text editor. I will use Notepad++, but if you don't have Notepad++, just use any other text editor of your choice. I will zoom this so that you can clearly see the code. I am writing a simple statement for printing Hello World. To run this code, go to the file location and type CMD. It will open the command prompt. Type Lua 54 to see if Lua is installed properly. You will see some version info about Lua. Let's exit from this. To run the script file, type Lua 54 space first Lua script to Lua and hit enter. It is showing hello world as the output. It means everything is working properly.